Yep, it's already 9.24 in the a.m. And I just woke up. <laughs> so, getting a late start to a day is not always a good thing. But today, I don't mind it because I went to bed late last night around uh, 1 o'clock because we were out with our friends. And then we came home and I edited the vlog. So, and then I slept in. I actually woke up about, uh, I think, uh, 6.30, 7 o'clock. And then I went back to bed for another two hours. So my wife is actually going to the gym, but I am not going with her. Because today is the day of rest. Funny, because I really, really want to go with her. I really want to go. But I have to at least rest my body. You know, I can't be doing this and burning myself out too quickly because I did six straight days I want to make it where in about a month I'm gonna be just oh, I don't want to go I don't want to go so I decided not to go with her so that's why I'm out right now getting gas but I'll be back at it tomorrow so let me tell you something being around the World Series of Poker being around the atmosphere was really inspiring to go play some more it, it was just you know, I always see poker from the dealer side because that's what I do. It's my job. But seeing it as someone who, watching it on my off time, just watching it and feeling that atmosphere is like, God, I got, I want to go play. I want to freaking play all these cash games, all these tournaments, and just you know try to you know be in the competition like I was back when I used to play a lot. Your boy Ronnie Bizzle will be out there. He will be out there sometime this summer playing. That's a Garen freaking T. I will be out there. Made it to the gas station when that light right there just turned on. Look at that. I had 35 miles to go. But I made it. And just as I expected, this place is packed. <laughs> That's better. Well, today my wife is actually going to play a poker tournament. Uh, she's playing the Golden Nugget. I think it's a 150 buy-in, but it's like a $100,000 guaranteed prize pool tournament. Now, this was a tournament I was supposed to play today, but then I found out that it's like a, uh, I think, a three-day event or a two-day event. So I would have to, if I made it through day one, I would have to come back on Sunday to play. Unfortunately, I have to work on Sundays, and I don't want to risk it because I'm. If I played, I'm going into a tournament knowing that, feeling that I'm going to make the day two. So I don't want to. I didn't want to risk playing and then having to come back on Sunday and then have to work. So I. So I am not going to play, but my wife's going to play, so I'll be sweating her. Hopefully she'll take it down. But I am gonna play one of those golden nugget tournaments. It's gotta be a day where it doesn't um, conflict with my work. Because although I am gonna play more, I am not gonna lose out the chance of making money during the World Series of Poker. And when the going's good, which is what it's gonna be this month, I have to take advantage of it. Hopefully my wife will take it down in a big way. So today is going to be super casual Saturday. Uh, my wife just left. She's on her way to play that poker tournament at the Golden Nuggets. And then my daughter needs a jewelry box. She said, Dad, I need a jewelry box. <laughs> so this gives an opportunity to go thrifting. And look how I'm dressed t-shirt and my uh, gym shorts super super casual guys so I'm gonna head out to a thrift store probably my favorite thrift store in this entire world and uh, see if I find a jewelry box and of course do a little thrifty for myself for the eBay business my thrifting part of today my daughter All right Look how freaking it is hot out here. This is like the beginning of 100 degree weather. It's like 103 degrees today. What? And it's gonna be like 100 degrees pretty much till like Wednesday or till Thursday. 
So, enjoying the uh, sun here. This nice weather, it's super nice. But yep, summer is here. Although it's still fishy, it's still fishy spring still, but oof. Can you imagine how it's gonna be when it's fishy summer? When it's 102 degrees right now? So I made it to my absolute favorite thrift store, Desert Industries. Let's go inside and see if we can find some deals. And then a jewelry box for her. So far, this has been a decent haul. Not bad at all. Here we got one, two, three bags of stuff. Let's go. So this is going to be another decent haul for your boy Ronnie Bezel. Three bags of stuff, didn't spend too much, that's going to yield some high profits. So I'm going to make a quick stop here at this small little thrift store that I rarely go to. I've been here one time and the prices are kind of over overpriced, but the clothing was cheap. You know, that's my specialty, so I'm going to see, first of all, if it's open, and second of all, ooh, I think it is open, here it is. There it is right there. Let's check it right here. There's the place. This is the... Uh, let's check it out. Clothing from one dollar. Shoes from five. Let's go check out. This is called Odds and Ends Thrift Store. So let's go check it out. Oh, pretty quick. Uh, I actually came here a long, long time, long, long time ago. And the prices were pretty high. And the prices are still high. I mean, the quality of stuff is really good. But the prices are really high. I mean, if I were to buy for myself, yeah. But when you're reselling, no, this is not good. That's it, Rihanna. Time to head back. Home. Home. Here. Look what we saw. We have to stop because it's so freaking hot. So DQ, which stands for Dairy Queen. Let's go. Check out this guy. This guy is freaking screaming at the freaking Dairy Queen person. <laughs> I get it. everything he's ordering. <laughs> yeah, we got Elvis Presley over here. <laughs> so my daughter got the Oreo Blizzard, and I got the caramel shake. Oh yeah, let's tear it up, Anna. Mm. Mm. <laughs> but ladies and gentlemen, your boy Ronnie Bizzle continues. What a processed inventory that I got. All the stuff I got from the thrift store. I'm gonna do, I'm gonna do measurements, take pictures and all the good stuff. All while I'm watching the Stanley Cup playoffs. I am actually rooting for Nashville, I want them to win. So I'm doing that for the rest of the afternoon, enjoying myself. No worries today guys, just chilling out. So look what's for dinner guys. A little steak action on the barbecue and a little potato action. Steak and potatoes. Oh my god, this is, this is a great meal. Continuing the old relaxing Saturday here in Las Vegas. Yep, that's for dinner. Don't worry, I'm not gonna eat it all. But look at that. Steak, potatoes, green beans, oh yeah. And there they are enjoying the big steak dinner I cooked. These knuckleheads. One, two, three. Beans. He'll be graduating next week. Um, um, um. She'll be. She'll be. Here until she's 29. Here until she's 29. <laughs> I finished this. And you? Middle yeah, school. Okay. And that, folks, will end today's vlog, June 3rd, 2017. Like I said, it was a super casual Saturday, just chilling out. I really did. I really didn't do anything. I really didn't, besides the thrifting. Um, I'm gonna edit the vlog that you're watching right now, and then I'm gonna finish off the night by pretty much chillaxing while working on eBay, and then try to get to bed early because tomorrow I go back to work, and. 
with the World Series of Poker Colossus still going on. I'm going to tell you right now, it's going to be a busy, 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 busy day. So I'm going to get a lot of rest because I'm going to need all the energy for tomorrow. So anyways, comment, like, and subscribe. Please share with your friends. And I will see you tomorrow. Thanks for watching. Your boy, Ronnie Bizzle.